All right, guys, so here, I still have a pumpkin over here. Oh my gosh, we need to put that away. It's after Thanksgiving. Anyway, I just made a carob and peppermint banana smoothie with six bananas, and I am loving it. It's delicioso. Hey guys, got a green smoothie here and a green vals. <laughs> it's like my favorite one. It's usually just the right size. Open mouth, so it's so easy to clean. Just put about a handful of romaine and six bananas. That's like my lucky number, I guess, when it comes to bananas anyway. Have a taste. Mm. Who'da thunk it? Green freaking smoothies could actually taste good. Hey guys, it's Clary Marie and Rocky here. We just got back from a skate. It was about a mile and a half, our usual skate these days. And then I was also spent an hour on my lovely exercise bike. And yes, I was watching TV. And I'll never tell what I was watching. My guiltiest pleasure. <laughs> I would lose all my subscribers. Maybe if you can guess. But yep, I love the exercise bike. It's totally rock and roll. Totally awesome. So yeah, now I am making up a little snack that I can eat while I cook dinner. Doesn't look too appetizing, I know. It's got got a little bit of orange juice. This has got a tablespoon of flax seed, fresh flax seed. I'm going to grind it up in here because, of course, it is, um, that's the best way to do it, basically. And we got this salsa that there was just a little bit left. So, basically, I'm going to blend that up and use it to top my very simple salad, which I have some salad sprinkle herbs on there. It's going to be good. Okay, so right now I'm actually stirring in just a little bit of this curry paste. It's so, so good. It's totally vegan. I actually buy this from Amazon Prime. I, it's one of those things that last me so long and it just is so perfect. So I just put it right in there and a little bit of this just goes a long way. So that's why it's really... I feel that it's a really good deal, all in all. Really just makes me have an instant meal, you know. It is very salty, but that's why, you know, you don't need a lot, like I said. So this is gonna be so good, I'm really excited. I just love Masaman curry, and this, oh, this is pretty much a Masaman curry. So tasty. Doesn't get any easier or better than this. Holy freaking cow, this just looks so amazing. It tastes so good. Rocky, are you jealous? Oh my goodness. I gotta move all this Christmas crap on my table and eat. <laughs> so good. This is heavenly. It is. Or is it? That's what they are. It might be. It might be too spicy for you. Oh. It might be too hot for me. <laughs> oh yeah, had to get some peas after I've eaten the half the plate, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Literally all I added was that curry paste and the peanut butter too. So it was probably three or maybe even, yeah, probably about three tablespoons on the peanut butter powder. So just in case you want to know how to make it, don't forget to give me a like if it looks good and down if it looks disgusting and you would never eat it in your life. <laughs> I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to eat your food.